Hello traders, John at StockBookie.com. Today we're looking at AMD on the daily, weekly, monthly time frames using technical analysis here at StockBookie.com. If you like these videos, go to my website, sign up, it's free, or click down here in the bottom right hand corner and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Traders, if you're looking for a new broker, check out CobraTrading.com slash promo slash StockBookie bookie best in the business been using these guys for years if you're an active trader check out cobratrading.com you won't be disappointed all right daily chart 115 million on the day 1.37 percent red and 17 cents down on the day we did hold this gap fill at 1146 and the 750 retrace at 1132 and boom right back up above the key trend line guys we have two key trend lines this lower up sloping one and this upper down sloping one it seems like every time it tries to get above that it comes right back in gets above retests bounces up right back in guys just like down in here we touch it there and actually we were making uh, higher lows coming in here then we slipped a little bit a little bit bearish right here popped up and boom right back down so as long as we stay above this trend line and the gap and these low pivots it should be fine bulls but what you really want to see if you're bullish you want to see this thing push up buy the dip mentality get above the MAs again you got to get above the 200 the 50 and the 20 if it gets above that and starts holding this upper trend line then it could possibly be ready to go um, uh, for higher prices you still have a couple gaps to fill up in here and good resistance so we'll have to give this one a little bit of time and see where it goes bears now bears if this thing starts to go sideways for the next seven days 10 days 14 days going uh, holding this trend line that could be a possible setup bearish setup for lower prices so watch for that lower prices meaning around 998 double bottom you have a gap down here too around 1016 but anywhere in this area that's what your target would be if this starts to shoot up then you're probably looking at the 1450 area up in here these double tops if it gets past that then you know then you're looking at 1469 15 bucks and then the 1550 area there so right now you're kind of in the middle of the range no, nothing really telling us other than holding these lower support areas which is good so let's see what we get for a setup in the next week or two on the weekly chart close though it's telling us an, uh, another story we did close below the 50 ma on the on the weekly a little bit bearish we still have this little bit of a topping tail as well holding so we came back started going a little bit bearish popped up into this high the 1420 or the 750 going up couldn't um, could get past it came in a little bit and boom down on earnings we are at that trend line again we talked about that on the daily so we're still holding that trend line if this trend line gives up guys I think 988 is in the picture and then this 940 is in the picture too which is going to be another big area of support if that gives it up weekly chart guys 200 MA if the markets give it up that's sometimes the target and with this one not touching it since April of 2016 back in here sorry guys that that could be an area that this thing could want to go to you're still gonna have great support at eight bucks and then in this consolidation around 650 or so but let me tell you guys you know we're, we're holding this big inside bar on the weekly I tried to get above it came back in tried it again came back in just can't get above this bar and hold and confirm every time we get above it, it comes right back in guys so be aware of that again you have a pennant bulls you got to get above this area above the 1438 and then possibly more upside bears if you start going sideways then you're looking at you know the 1135 the ten dollar and if that breaks gosh eight bucks easily so either way guys we still have to wait for pattern setup we still have to see what this thing brings us in the next couple of weeks and then ultimately um, it's going to be up to the market too with a market trade like the spy goes down this will go down with it but looking at the monthly chart time frame 10 bucks is a huge number guys period the 20 ma is finally curling up into this area i was giving this thing a price target of like seven bucks eight bucks a while back but as this can curls up into the ten dollar area this will be a big area of support right at 10 if this comes back in guys i will be a buyer there short term maybe for a bounce or two or a buck or two bounce if this area slides then we will be going down testing this eight dollar seven dollar area 
in a heartbeat, guys. So just beware with the AMD, guys. Great trading vehicle for uh, traders like myself. But right now, it's just holding support down in here. Let's see what pattern it gives us uh, next week, and then we'll reevaluate it on the weekend update. All right, guys. Thanks for stopping by, watching my video. I really do appreciate it. God bless. See you on the charts.